Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Persona 3 Reload. Last time we were traversing further and further upwards through Tartarus. We got our ass kicked, but we rallied and kicked ass from this fucking beetle. I'm still pissed off, but we moved on. We have reached the new barrier um, and now we are, yeah... Uh, just days before the final uh, shadow boss. Uh, so let's go. Oh, hello. I do. All right. Hope you guys are in for good episode hey, so... I'm really excited there's gonna be a full moon soon we'll finally be done let's give it everything we've got of course yeah after all this is over let's celebrate sounds like a plan okay I'll be honest, I completely forgot what we were doing. So, Yukari's maxed out. Uh, we do not have high essay. Yuko. You know what? Let's do Yuko, because... We... Rarely see her. I think she's here, in the hallway somewhere. I believe she's at the very end? Yeah. There's no practice today, so it's the perfect time to relax. If you're leaving, want to hang out? Yeah, we got the white rider. The horse with all those eyes on it. Yeah, let's spend some time. Cool, where should we go then? Should we get some to eat? Maybe do some karaoke? Let's decide on the way out. There was this one time I left some tissues in the pocket of my running pants. And then I washed it without realizing. Oh, boy, did that make a mess. Oh, can you hang on a sec while I put my shoes on? I've done that before. Not again. It's the same stupid prank every time. Talk about unoriginal. There's a piece of gum on Yuko's locker. Oh, at least my shoes are safe. Going that far would have been crossing the line. Does this happen often? After the first few times, I stopped counting. I was pissed off at first, but eventually I just got used to it. Getting worked up about this would just tire me out. It's not worth it. But if I catch her in the act, I am fully prepared to grab her and teach her a lesson. Uh, that was a joke, okay? I'm a nice girl, really. Come on, let's go. Mm -hmm. So I figured this might be a good time to update our team uniform. What do you think of switching to running tights? They say it reduces wind resistance. Hey, look over there. It's Nishiwaki-san. Is that your new boyfriend? Aunt, the next one already, I see. <sighs> Impressive, Nishiwaki-san. We're not dating. He's just a friend from the team. Come on. No need to act all polite in front of him. Just tell it how it is. I'm surprised you could even get such a handsome guy. Maybe I should become a team manager too. Okay, I mentioned this a couple of videos ago. Like, why is there such a stigma if like a, a boy and a girl hang out? It's like, oh my God, they're dating. It's such a scandal. Like, who the fuck cares? Like, is it really that much of a big deal in like the West, the Eastern cultures? Like they're hanging out, so what? Even if they are dating, so what? Like I don't get what, why are they making fun of each other? If anything, they should probably be jealous. You should be lucky to find love. You've got it all wrong, as usual. <laughs> don't do it. You'll just be running around after everyone all day. And it's not very attractive for a girl to be so muscular, you know? <laughs> not so loud. Her boyfriend's, like, right here. I kind of feel bad for her. 
that's really what you want to do, I won't stop you. But you're better off looking for a boyfriend elsewhere. You know, I just realized. Look at the model differences between Yuko and me versus, like, the other two girls. Like, the eyes are, like, bigger, the mouth... Like, they look less detailed. It's so weird. It's like very little, effort, very little effort was put into them. That's so weird. A manager is a busy job. You won't have time to go around sticking gum on people's shoe lockers. What on earth are you talking about? <laughs> I haven't got a clue what that means. Of course not. It was just a random example. What's wrong? Did I say something to offend you? Not at all. <laughs> hey! Uh, let's just go already. You go spicy, eh? Sorry you got dragged into that. Don't worry about it. No. You shouldn't have to deal with that. Sorry. Uh, I should probably fill you in before you get the wrong idea about me. Let's go sit down. That girl in the black tights? We went to the same middle school. Back then, there was this boy on the basketball team who asked me out, and we started dating. But, turns out, he was seeing her at the same time. When she found out, she said I stole her boyfriend. Even though I was a victim, too. She blamed me because I was the manager of the basketball team. Isn't that just ridiculous? And after I became the track team manager here in high school, that set her off on me again. But really, all I want to do is support others so they can be the best they can be. Remember the gum on my locker? That was probably her doing. She's definitely the type to hold a grudge. Oh, those girls have way too much time on their hands. All they do is complain and gossip. Why don't they do something more productive? They're the ones who should get a lecture from Akoda. You're not putting enough thought into your future. Tell that to them, not me. Oh, that reminds me. Sorry for what they said about you. They called you my boyfriend. Must have made you feel awkward, huh? Uh, might be a problem. I'll just put I'm honored. Because it's probably going to get the most, the best response. Uh, hey, you! How can you say that with a straight face? And how many other girls have you used that line on, huh? When it comes to relationships, you should never play with a woman's emotions. Oh, right. Make sure you don't tell Kaz or anyone else about the two-timing thing, okay? You're the only one I've told. Oh, also, I broke up with that two-timing jerk a long time ago. Just so you know, uh, you, you might be thinking, so what, right? Yeah, <laughs> what am I saying? <laughs> hey, I'm in a committed relationship with Yuki. Not Yuki, Yukari. A lot of you names. I'm Yuki, that's Yuko, we're dating Yukari. Yuki and Yukari. Well, that dragged on. It's late. We should be getting home. I'll see you soon. Okay. I see you're back. Only three days left. Make sure you're fully prepared. I'm ready to train anytime. Nah, we good. We good. I think mm. we're fully trained. I don't think Strega will simply allow us to defeat the last shadow. It will either try to stop us outright or secretly set a trap for us. What do you think they'll do? I think they'll... That's a good question. I think they'll try to stop us outright. Yes. I agree. That seems to be their only viable option. If they were to set a trap, Yamagishi would be able to detect it and we could avoid it easily. I'm glad she agrees. Autumn, the lights are beautiful. Particularly at the Moonlight Bridge in the Bay Area. Well said. Um. Hi. I'm starting to get nervous for our next battle this upcoming full moon. At times like this, it's best to keep a cool head. So let's just stay calm and go for the win. Um. Only three more days till the full moon. It's finally starting to hit me. Kind of nervous. 
I gotta keep it together. I should try to relax a little. Um. Strega might be planning something, but that doesn't matter. So I'll never forgive them for what they did. Uh, when can I put stuff in here again? 11-11. Well, that'll be easy to remember. Mm, no one there. Nothing. The wait is over. Hey! If you're gonna do some gardening, I'll come too. Yep. Actually, yeah. Let's tend the... Alright. Let's tend to the spinach so we can get more items. I'd say that's a. Is it Pharos or Strega? Strega. There's something worth looking at from here. The moon is almost perfect. It'll be full in just three more days. So it would seem. I have no intention of relinquishing my abilities and living an empty life. To continue existing as we are, or to die powerless. I hear you. I know how important this is to you, Takaya. To us, we can't afford to lose it. And besides... Jin? If the Dark Hour disappears, we might forget everything that happened, won't we? I'd forget you and Chidori, the things we did together, our time at the facility, all of it. To Actually, me, that's a good point. That's a fate worse than death. I couldn't care less if that damned facility got erased from my memory. Having this uncontrollable power forced on us, watching everybody we knew disappear one by one. There's just one thing I refuse to forget. Back when I was trapped in that living hell, you spoke to me. Thanks to what you said, I learned how to keep myself going. Your words gave my life meaning, Takaya. If I forget that, I won't have any reason to be alive. <sighs> it may not be much of a purpose compared to yours. It was just a couple of words, I know. But they meant the whole world to me. So I can't lose this fight either. Is that so? Hmm. Well then, why don't we find out together? Whom will fate elect to choose? Them or us? <laughs> right. That's interesting. I hadn't considered that. Will the same thing happen to us? Would we forget everything? There's no school today. It's almost time for the home shopping show. It's a mix. I'm going to do it. Uh, the Become a Samurai set. Now listen up, all you diehard fans of the Sengoku era. Put this on and feel just like a noble samurai. Good, good. We have the Miyohu Muramasa. So well made, who believed it's a replica? Oh my goodness, it's wonderful. But wait, there's more. Not bad, kid. We'll throw in this Samurai's Haori too. Guess how many? Forty thousand. Yeah, we got the money. I don't know what the first thing is. I'm guessing it's a weapon. Thanks, kid. A uh, mystery doll set. But. So we're not going to do Hayase, we're going to do Akinari. Um, but first... So, I don't know... So a couple of episodes ago, uh, I was talking, I was trying to think about the beautiful tile and the music. Um, like, where to get this stuff. I don't know about this one, but I'm wondering if this one... A small rectangular tile with a peacock painted on it. Uh, I'm wondering if it, I'm wondering if it's a mahjong tile. 
um, because there is a Mahjong place. I'm not too familiar with with the uh, Mahjong, like how to play it, but there is one place here. Uh, this place here, Mahjong Parlor, Red Hawk. Cigarette smoke and a nervous tension fill the air. Maybe I can muster up the courage to enter. I picked up, my, I plucked up my courage and slept onto the stairs. A customer is walking out. He looks defeated. I lost it all, man. Come on, kid, give me some luck. Nope, don't say a word. I challenge you to a match. Rock, paper, scissors. Uh, paper. Wow. Guess my luck really has dried up. Thank you. You've helped me realize that gambling is a lost cause. Starting today, I'm stopping cold turkey. Was I right? I'm pretty sure no matter what you picked, you were going to win anyway. Uh, here's a little something to say, help say thanks. Anyway, you shouldn't be hanging around a place like this. Now, nah, beat it. I obtain a Mahjong tile. It has a drawing of a bird. Oh yeah. I feel I feel a little vindicated now. Good day. Are you accepting a request? Wonderful. Oh, is that not the item I've been seeking all this time? What a beautifully painted peacock. Ah, so this is a mahjong tile. Is that true? It's used in a game, you say? I wonder if it's an es as essential as a card is in a card game. At any rate, thank you for this piece. I will cherish it. I got a scrub brush. Mikazuki Munichika. Okay, so I think that's just what I ordered. Uh, so this one I have no idea. Used to battling with a persona? Within the school that broadcasts music. Very well then. Was there a music class? I'm sure there was a music class somewhere. Uh, but school's closed today. So we'll be heading to Naganaki Shrine <laughs> to talk with Miki. Or Akinari. Kamiki. Uh, hey. Do we have sun? I'd like to speak to you with you again. Should fate allow it? Yep. It's been time. Thanks. Through our conversations, this bench becomes the bridge that connects me to humanity. Say, how do you feel about a pink alligator? Uh, what? Actually, I'm gonna say sounds fine to me. I thought so too. There we go. I knew you'd understand. See, it's the main character of a story that I'm writing. He was born in a lush green forest, but he turned out to be pink. He stands out so much that he can't hunt for food easily, so he's always hungry. The other animals dislike him and call him disgusting, almost like he's cursed. So, he was used to living alone. But one day, he made a friend. It was a little bird that had trouble flying. Every day, the bird would stand on the pink alligator's back and practice. It's kind of embarrassing to tell you this. So, what do you think? Sounds interesting. Really? I've never written a story before, so I'm worried it's not going to be very good. But what matters is that I'm writing it for myself. Perhaps I can show you the entire novel someday. Writing a novel? I actually came up with it the other day. I decided I wanted to write a heartwarming story just for myself. I'd like it to be a hopeful tale about finding the meaning in one's life. I think of you when I write. It's like I can hear you telling me not to die just yet. Kamiki smiled weakly. 
really sad, man. It's really tragic. The wind is going to pick up soon. I can feel these kinds of things now. I hope I have enough time. We should leave. I'd like to see you again sometime. Man. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Only two days remain. It's been a long journey, but we're finally here. We're the only ones who can defeat it, so don't let your guard down until the very end. By the way... I've been so busy lately that I haven't been able to visit Chidori. Again, I keep forgetting about Chidori. Has she just been to the hospital for like, what, like three months? Four months? Like, is that even possible? It's strike I haven't done anything to get her back? Well, we're almost done. After we kill the last shadow, I'm gonna run straight to the hospital to see her. Oh, that's right. Well, what would happen? Well, what would everyone like for their last meal? Why don't I order a delivery of buffalo wings or some victory yaki? Ugh, I'm being ignored. <sighs> well, I guess they're too focused to enjoy my jokes. Yeah, that's that's it. On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R, episode 37. Here comes the Emperor. Who could possibly eat more than Owl and love more than Condor? Who? On to today's news. The newest handheld gaming system has officially gone on sale today. Mile-long lines have formed across the country. Mile-long li Think about that. Mile-long lines. Jesus, man. Oh. Uh, no. I I didn't want to talk to you. Oh. I wanted to talk to you, Kari. Hey. This will make all the shadows disappear, right? Along with the dark hour, Tartarus, and everything else. Well, no, it won't make my dance, my dad's sins disappear. Hmm. And Sir says we'll probably come across Striga in the next battle. Personally, I hope we do. I'm gonna wreck them for what they did to Shinji. there mm, nothing to do in the town oh uh sure why not let's yes. go i'm gonna have the biggest harvest of fucking spinach man looks like this will be a big harvest Monday, Monday, Monday. Good morning. Well, tomorrow's the day. I'm ready. <laughs> What's tomorrow? Nice one. I shouldn't be surprised. Calm as always, leader. I'm positive that the last shadow will appear tomorrow, but Strega might be up to something as well. Anyway, please be prepared. Class has Reader. ended. Tomorrow's the final battle. Are you ready? If you need supplies or equipment, make sure to get everything today. Yeah, that's a good point. Hey. Tomorrow's the day. I couldn't concentrate in class at all today. What about you? Uh, yeah, same here. <sighs> Not good, dude. You better find a way to chill out. Um... Fuka and Hidetoshi. So we'll probably do Fuka. Uh, but before that, let's head to Polonia Mall. Let's stock up on some stuff. Those youngsters who look all down in the mouth should try harder to make some friends. They're all on that net thing nowadays. They probably don't know how to talk to real people. Well, you're not wrong. 
For some reason, we just got a delivery of a bunch of mysterious dolls. You know anything about this? <sighs> dolls. Your face says you do. Just take them. Oh. Homunculus. Okay. There's I'm still more. Think of it. They found that missing schoolgirl the other day. I tried questioning her, but her answers didn't make any sense. She said some kid saved her from an attack by a black thing. Much obliged. She left a reward with us, so I'll hand her over to you. Ooh, magic talisman. Now you're here. They found a missing person the other day. Oddly, hand over a big wad of cash. Seems he was the president of some company. He was pretty damn low profile for someone so self-important. Anyway, the police can't accept reward money, so you can have it. A hundred thousand. Nice, bro. There's still more. I'm gonna think of it. They found that grade school kid the other day. She brought this here as a way of saying thanks. Here, it's all yours. A felt doll. There's still more. I guess I haven't collected the rewards for saving all these people in uh, Tartarus. They found that missing guy the other day. I tried questioning him, but his answers didn't make any sense. He said some kids saved him from attack Much by a black thing. Yeah. Berserker seal. By the way. They found the missing woman the other day. I tried questioning her, but her answers didn't make any sense. I'm guessing her memory is fuzzy. One. At any rate, she left this as a token of her appreciation. So I think you should have it. Good to see you. Um, okay, let's sell bring? all uh, all Wanna the items. Sell in bulk. Holy shit! I haven't sold anything for a while. Sure. It's a deal. Hmm? You finished? Okay, first off, Easy. let's exit. Let's let's take stock. Hang on. So, avaricious ring, fifteen percent XP. So that's pretty cool. High counter. The mark of a fearsome berserker. High chance to counter physical attacks. Invigorate. Adorable doll received from Michael. Restores a tiny bit of SP each turn. 50 SP. A charm which might... Uh, a charm which might use. Kindles immense magical power. Homunculus we know. Yeah, it takes it for the insta kill. Uh, random ailments. Can also clean the area of shadows. So scrub brush, I think is Ken. Yeah, but it's it's lower. Should have gotten that one a while back. Okay, so I have the main brooch. I'm actually probably going to take um, the felt doll. Actually, you know what, guys? I'm going to take a quick washroom break. I'll be right back. Oh, jeez, guys. All right. So, yeah. I think uh, I'm going to take the felt doll. Um, and whoever, I guess, uh, whoever I go with, I'll probably give different loadouts, depending. Because... That Berserker Seal is pretty damn good. Uh, and what do I have? Or what did I have? I think I had that one. The I had the Warrior Seal. Um, and I'll have to give the, the Magic Talisman to someone, too. Again, really all depends who we go with. Um, but let's go back in. Now you're here. Yeah. So we sold it. We got a lot of money, man. What'll it be? Uh, running a little sale today. See if anything Maybe. catches your eye. Enchanted earrings. Oh, uh, resist. Uh, Feel free rage. to buy whatever you want. But I suggest picking something that complements your physique. Okay, because we have the money, I'm gonna buy this. Uh, because last time there was that one, there was that boss in the the Mudan areas, Mudan, Moden. I forget what it's called. The side areas in Tartarus where you fight like bosses. Um, I couldn't not get raged. 
so I think I'm gonna get everything four of good these. here. Take your time. Is that what you want? Great. It's all yours. Wait, did I quit? Already it? have that equipped. You sure? Great. I got. You already have that. All right. You already have it. Great. It's all yeah, yours. I'll change it all afterwards. Um. Yeah. Well, let's take as long as you need. So two twenty-three. Twenty-three is a lot of extra damage. How much it's is been a long time. Made up your mind? Again, I got the money, it's so why not? Equip. Um No, I don't sell. That's okay. Low shock. That is quite an increase. That's uh, 36. Everything look good here? Yeah. Right, then. Um, that you could sell. Reduce luck, dark damage, eh? That was great. I yours. got him, man. Uh, sell the Buster Blade. Yeah, it's fine. You can sell that. Crush your fist. Um, so 21,000 just for an extra 8 damage. Uh, I don't think it's worth it. I think we're okay with what we have. Um, plus he's got physical evasion, so... Noble Saber. Yeah, what we have is better than. I have than no this idea stuff. what you're fighting out there. Just don't get in over your heads. 33. Yeah. Better accuracy. That too. All right then. Don't sell that one. 27. Eh? All right, and it's also better accuracy. Raise attack when on the receiving end of a shift. Nah. Everything look good here? Great. It's all yours. Don't sell that one. And we're back to Makoto. What'll it be? Take as long as you need. Here we go. Kaiser armor. How much is this? 28? That what you want? Take your time. 28 for 31 defense. Yeah, I think that's worth Everything it. Everything Alright then. Quit. Uh, sell it. That's fine. Everything like it. Alright then. Don't sell that one. Okay, so we have... Do we have four? Two. Yeah, we do. Oh. Oh my god, yes. Everything look good here? Alright then. Uh, you can sell that one. Titanium dog suit. Oh my god, look at that difference. Ooh, 20 SP. It's been you know a long what? journey. Huh? I'm gonna buy this right, one. Right, then. You can sell that one. Okay, and now the footwear. Uh, take as long as you need. Eighteen thousand. Everything look good here. Having second thoughts. Sorry guys, one more second. Apologies again, folks. Um, it's been a long journey. Don't lose focus until it's over. Okay. 
Everything. Take your time. So I don't know if these are necessarily worth it. That was having second thoughts. Yeah, the shift boost is the shift boost is worthless, but the evasion is good. Everything. You know what? Fine. It's all yours. Equip. Uh, sell it. That's fine. Yeah. That what you want? Great. It's all yours. Sell it. That what you want? All right then. Everything. All right then. Yeah. What'll it be? Hmm? You finished? I'm finished. Alright, we did a lot, man. Okay, so we did that. Um, let's go back to the school. Um gym hallway. Let's see if there's like a music class or something. It's used for PE and training ground as a kendo team. Indoor swimming pool. Door leads to the swimming pool. Swim team uses it after school. Faint scent of chlorine wafts through the air. I actually really like that smell. Door leads outside the practice field. Feel an unbreakable bond with Miyamoto. Doesn't seem that our relationship can get closer. No, no, no. Uh, there has to be some kind of music class. What do you want? I'm playing an RPG on my cell, so buzz off. Uh, that's Bebe. Oh no, that's the art club, sorry. Uh, <laughs> oh no, I don't wanna. Science room. It's a science room. It seems to be used as a dark room for the photography club. It stores the tools for experiments as well as the chemicals used to develop photos. Okay. Lab. There may be dangerous chemicals inside that are not going without permission. Um. What's this? Home ec prep room. Wonder if the teacher sorts and organizes all the sewing supplies by themselves. Music room. Seems to be where the music club beats. Through the frosted window, it feels like the portraits of musicians are looking at me. Hmm. Music prep room? Seems to be mainly used by the music club. Lots of instruments are stored here. Okay, so I think we're on the right track. I think. Welcome. Uh, talk. Take your time looking. Pick anything you like. Oh, thanks. How many Taiyaki do we have left? Self two. Faculty office? There's nothing I need to do here right now. With Mitsuruno? Uh. Ooh, I could start a thing with her, but uh, not right now. Maybe at the end? Printing room? I wonder if the printouts the teachers hand out are printed here. Welfare pr practice room. Wonder how much importance this school places on subjects such as welfare. Uh, maybe I can hear a supplementary lesson? Do I want a lesson? Sure, maybe I can get an achievement out of it. 
I uh, guess we'll get started. Well then, should we continue where we left off last time? I have a lot to cover, so I hope you're prepared. Sorry guys, you can just skip over all this. Cool. I like your spirit. We've covered the fundamentals, so I'll teach you how to use all 78 major and minor arcana. Let's talk about the basic spread, shall we? Mm. To review, the tarot is made of 22 major arcana and 56 minor arcana, for a total of 78 cards. Is that clear? Each card has its own inherent meaning. As such. Many are daunted by the full deck because of the sheer amount of cards, but take heart. It is difficult to learn all the meanings, but having them all actually makes your reading easier. The more details one has available, the easier it is to craft a story. Well then... I've already explained the major arcana, so let me give you an outline of the minor arcana. Minor arcana are divided into four classes, called suits. Do you recall when I told you that this is what common playing cards were modeled after? That is to say... The wands, cups, swords, and coins correspond to club, heart, spades, and diamonds. So the wands are clubs, hearts are uh, cups, spades are swords, and coins are diamonds. That's interesting. Each suit has 10 numbered cards, ranging from ace to 10, as well as the four face cards, king, queen, knight, and page, unlike the three face cards in common decks. The page is sometimes called prince, though he's essentially a knight in training. Okay, then. The four face cards are called court cards. That term will come up again, so remember it well. There are 14 types in total, between the pip cards or number cards, and the face or court cards. These 14 types have four cards each, for a total of 56 cards in the Minor Arcana. As such. And now you know the makeup of the Minor Arcana. As for how to use them in a reading, it's actually the same as a Major Arcana. Keep in mind the meaning of each card and the direction it faces and use your inspiration to create a story. That is to say. In the Minor Arcana, each suit, number, and core type has its own meaning. One of the best ways to memorize this is to imagine them in a 4x14 grid. So, continuing on. And now, each of the su four suits' meanings in brief. Wands for planning and growth, cups for love and sentiment, swords for trials, and coins for wealth. As for the basic meaning of each of the numbered cards, that is to say. ace is the beginning, two is balance, three is growth, four is stability, five is change, six is balance again, seven is a new start, eight is success, nine is attainment, and ten marks a terminus or the end. Court cards represent people and their strengths. It could be a client or other people well, involved. Then. The page represents children and the offering of knowledge. The knight is youth uh, and boundless energy. The queen represents adult women, while the king represents a mature men. It's said that to grasp the meaning of the cards, it's important to communicate with them. As such. Now then, let's move on to the method of using the full arcana to tell fortunes. The basic procedure is the same you'll just be using more cards. Even with the full deck of 78, you must first shuffle, then cut, spread, and read. Hmm. The type of spread you use affects the procedure more than the number of cards in use. Don't get me wrong. The spread I'll be covering is done with this procedure too. Okay then. Now for a change in subject, I'll explain the various types of spreads. Last time we used the one card spread, so today we'll examine the other typical spreads. First remember that the spread is chosen according to the nature of the question. Hmm. Do you want an answer to a single question, or maybe an overview of the general future? Use the spread that best fits the request you have in mind. For example, if you want to tell the client's past, present, and okay, future, then. why not use a three-card spread, where you simply lay out three cards? Adding a card produces the four-card spread, identifying the past, present, nature of the problem, and future. If you use a seven-card hexagram spread, with a single card placed in the center of the hexagon. You can read both the nature of the problem and a countermeasure against it. So, continuing on. There's also a spread called question and answer involving two choices. This reading is done by setting two countermeasures against the question. That is to say. Finally, the most well-known spread is the classic Celtic cross. It's suited to telling fortunes with only the major arcana and is used often by both beginners and experts. Arrange two cards crossing each other in the center, then one more on all four sides of the cross. As such. Then place a pillar of four cards, known as the Spear of Destiny, next to it to the right. The, 
cross of six cards represents the overall situation, with the forward to the right making it concrete. Again, this forms the ten card spread known as the Celtic Cross. Well then... There are other spreads, like the Horseshoe, which is Diamond, or the Seven Candles of Life. And I've also heard rumors of so-called Normal, Triangle, and Cross spreads. There are far too many for me to teach you, so you can look into yourself if you're interested. Hmm... Whew, I believe it's time for my afternoon tea. That's it for today. Here, take the sun off you go. Oh, thank you. Okay, I, again, I wonder, there has to be something to this. Um, alright, so... But here's the music one. Perhaps it would be wise to check, check a location within the school that broadcasts music. That broadcasts music. Last time I was hanging out at the strip mall, I saw a dude with a wild fashion sense. Long wavy hair, no shirt, and tattoos all up and down his arms. I know it might be unreasonably warm, but he kind of went overboard. But hey, maybe it's cool to let your freak flag fly. If I was more like him, not giving a rip what people think, I wouldn't have a care in the world. Good to know. Uh, that's the women's washroom. What do we have here? Classroom 2E. I heard that Moriyama-san from Class 2E is going to transfer out. His father's sick, right? She didn't seem sad or anything. Now that I think about it. Even when she was acting all hype and stuff, she didn't seem like she was really having fun. I guess she has her own problems to deal with. It's Fuka in Natsuki's class, but Natsuki had to transfer due to family circumstances. Okay. PA room. I can hear bizarre music playing inside. What the heck is this song? Gekugan Boogie? Why does the school have music like this? Must be a teacher's themed song or something that plays when they enter a classroom. No way, man. That's crazy. Should I try entering the PA room? Yeah. Sorry, you have to have permission to be in... Huh? This song? I have no idea what it's for, but it says Gekukon Boogie on it. What? You want it? Are you serious? Sure, you can have it. We don't have any use for it anyway. Here. Now get out of here before you get me in trouble. Very nice. I should use the computer at the dorm if I want to look something up. Okay. Good day. All right, finally got Here the fucking are my music. Requests. Wonderful. Seems you've completed a request. What is this circular disc? Gekkon Boogie is written on one surface. Is there music stored inside of it? Then this sheet of paper must be the lyrics. Everybody was haiku writing. Those kids were fast as lightning. Very well, then. Mm, I can't imagine what it sounds like from the words alone. I'll have to listen to it later. Take this as your reward. Female uniform S. Bring me a giant creepy doll. That's also I used for to teaching. Think of it. I've heard whispers of a certain doll. One with an appearance so horrific, it invokes nightmares. But on the other hand, it may also be used as a tool for education. Perhaps one exists somewhere within the learning facility you attend. Would you mind searching for it? I will a report of... Very well, then. Okay. So what did I get? Summer uniform. Oh, I see. Okay. So... I heard there's a creepy looking doll in your world that also used for educational purposes. Would it be maybe in the nurse's office? 
like a skeleton or like the, the model of like a human being or whatever. Maybe I need to come back another day. What should we do with this? We can't burn it because that would release harmful chemicals. Maybe we should just throw it away. Should I try entering the science lab? Yeah. Enter. Entrez vous. Oh, you're Yuki from 2F. Do you have any interest in this anatomical model? See, I was right. I was just about to get rid of it. It's old and ugly, and the students think it's creepy. It's such a waste. I hope someone could take it, as long as they don't use it for anything weird. Yes, I think that's a good idea. I'll let you have it then. Well, off you go. I'm, not, I'm going to lock up this room now. Oh, Elizabeth. Good day. Sorry, Where I just want to knock this stuff wonderful. out, guys. Oh, is this a doll so feared by humans? I see. So it's called an anatomical model. The amount of detail is quite impressive. Is that so? But what makes it so terrifying? I find it rather cute. Just look at the way its round eyes stare into your soul. Thank you for this lovely doll. I will find an ideal place to display this. Okay, cool. Sengukan era helm. If I may say so. Uh, I would like for you to bring me a certain headgear. More specifically, this headgear is a helm that has existed since ancient times. Since this is an item rich with history, I expect that it will provide the wearer with quality defense. I believe you may be acquainted with someone who cherishes one such helm deeply. I will await a report of success. So I gotta talk to the teacher, maybe? Very well. Might have to go into the faculty office. Yeah, looks like it. What? Yes, Yuki? Did you have a question about my lecture? Hmm? Yes? What are you staring at? Is it my helm? Could that be it? Great! Is this really happening? Boy, oh boy, that's one discerning eye you got there, kid. Isn't this helm great? It is, isn't it? It's a historic masterpiece Masamune had since he was young. Mr. Ono keeps going on and on with his story. So Masamu gave this helm to his vassal before he departed. Such generosity. It's as if he foresaw his fate. <laughs> and so... And that's why I couldn't possibly part with it. I could give you something else from my personal collection, though. One with no connections to Masamu. If you still want one? Well, you do, right? Come see me again. I'll let you have it. I enjoyed the tales of Masamune. I have a deeper understanding of history. For a lot of good, that'll do me. If I come back with Mr. Ono at the faculty office another day, I might get my very own help. Well, it'll have to be whatever goes on in Tartarus. Or the, not Tartarus, the Dark Hour. Alright, so let's save. And then, let's chat. Yeah. Oh, hi. <laughs> if you're leaving now, would you like to go shopping with me? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Sorry for taking so long. I wanted to buy something to use as a secret ingredient in my cooking. But I couldn't really decide, and I wasn't sure how to use whatever I'd buy. Have we done this before?
start with the basics. Yes, you're right. I haven't even gotten the basics down yet. I'm getting way too ahead of myself. First thing I need to do is find something that I can actually make. I'm still having a lot of trouble getting things right, but I can't give up yet. Not after all your support. And it's not like I have any other redeeming qualities. You're a hard worker. No, that's not true at all. I mean, everyone in our group works hard. And beyond that, I think you all have something that you're good at. Not me. I mean, I guess I'm sort of good with machines, but that's it. It's honestly not worth mentioning. Really, I just happen to like them. It's not exactly something worth boasting about. When I was little, I remember my dad's hobby was to work on complicated sound equipment. He'd fix things like broken amplifiers or headphones that only played sound on one side. I've always loved watching him work on those things. This is really familiar to me. I feel like we may have gone, we may have rewound for some reason. Possibly to go to Tartarus or something. Probably why I was drawn to working with machines in the first place. But I don't think that would be very useful to repay everyone's kindness. Plus, if we do ever have any technical needs, like when we're fighting, then we've always got the Kirijo group's support. Not to mention that I'm kind of embarrassed about it all. I mean, it's not a very feminine hobby. That's not true. Later. Thank you. I sure seem to talk about my problems a lot, huh? So much stigma. Like, you do you, man. Do whatever you want. You like machines? Have at it. Hell of anything. Like, women mechanics are hot, man. Women like uh, electricians, they're fucking hot. I wonder why it's so easy talking to you. I feel like you stop me from being so negative all the time. Actually, I might owe a lot to you in that sense. I think Vuka trust me now. She better. We've only been with each other for like... Well, I mean team members for like, what, six months now? Oh, it's getting... Let's go. Let's go. All right. Tomorrow will finally be our last operation. Yeah, we've been through so much over the last half year or so. Don't you think? Didn't feel that long. Yeah, I guess it flew by. Hey, it was way better than just doing nothing, right? Besides, we made some new friends. <sighs> yes, that's true. Not a single thing we've done has been for nothing. It's been two and a half years since I got this power. And it's been worth it. Sonata-san. Morph. Don't forget, we got to meet Koro-chan too. Still, two and a half years is a long time, Sonata-senpai. Oh, wait. It's been even longer for I guess, hasn't it? I was in stasis for much of that time, so I haven't been operational for very long. How about you, Kirijo senpai You got your start before Sonata-san, right? Hmm? Me? Yes, it was just me at first. Of course, Seize wasn't around back then, and this was just a regular dorm. Did the chairman recruit you too? No, he didn't. I've been aware of the Dark Hour since I was a child. Once, my father's research team was ambushed yeah. by shadows while they were investigating Tartarus. Yeah, when I witnessed sense. the attack, I awakened to my persona. That's what happened? By the way, guys, you should try this. Um, well, it's backwards here, but it's spiced Coke. Um, I don't know if it's a thing in, uh, in the States. Uh, I live in Canada. 
Uh, I just found out about this. It's spiced, uh, this one's spiced with raspberry. Normally I don't like raspberry, but it's got a nice kick to it. I like it. Um, it's kind of like cherry coke, but with like a, an extra kick to it. Apparently I was the first ever to reliably control my persona. If that had never happened, then maybe none of you would be going through this right now. Senpai? Someone would have gotten involved eventually. It's not like we could just ignore what the shadows do to people. I suppose that's true. On the eve of the final shadow, I can feel a quiet passion from my friends. Are we gonna level the fool persona? We are. Level seven? Six. See, that's also a pretty telling thing. Like, if you're going into this game blind, um, not knowing what the fuck's gonna happen, you could tell from this alone, it's like, we're nowhere near the end of the story. We're only, what, six tenths of the way through? Tomorrow is our last operation, so make sure to rest up tonight. That reminds me of in Persona 5. Not really a spoiler, because you won't know the context, but like, they say like, this will be our final mission, like, five times. This stuff always pops up, it's just hilarious. It, not five times, I think it was like three times, like, this is our final ultimate mission. Like, three, maybe four times, but yeah. Uh, looks like the product art. Well, that was quick. It was literally one day. Miyoho Masamura. Equip. Uh, or, sorry. I am. Let's check it out first. Slash Evasion High. That. That is useful. It does so little damage. The anger of being tricked turns into power. Yeah. The thing is... Okay, so for those of you that don't really follow along with like the different uh, status effects, what Rage does... Um, is it makes the opponent just just attack. Like, no magic attacks or anything like that. Just whatever it is. Slash, bludgeoning, whatever it is. It's physical. Which means, if you have the sword, um, and you basically attack with it, and you have, like, a persona that, um, that, uh, nullifies or, like, resists, um, physical attacks... You're, you're untouchable. You are literally untouchable. Because you're just raging against this guy. And, you know. it Or, not, you're not raging. They're raging against you. They're, they're not thinking. The only problem is... Um, that, uh... You may have a persona that, you know, maybe resistant or has uh, null physical uh, status. A null effect. They're... They're immune to physical attacks, basically. But the other people don't. That is a sword worth keeping. Um, so survival trick. This is better. Slash evasion high. Um, I mean, we don't normally come across many uh, enemies that do physical damage, let alone slash. Or that don't do slash uh, damage, let alone physical. 
No, I was right the first time. I'm... It's late, guys. Oh, just yeah. don't mind me. You know what I mean. Hey, I almost forgot. We have tomorrow off. I'll probably just stay home and get rest, though. Gotta prepare for the last operation, too. Let's give it everything we got tomorrow. You have my thanks. Thank you for all you've done for us. Let's give it our all in the final battle. This is it. I'm gonna fight for my mom and Aragaki-san. Oh, it's so cute, these guys thinking it's it's the end. You're a Leo, then your lucky color is brown. Oh, that's a terrible lucky color. For even more luck, try removing a bookmark from the book you're still reading. I mean, don't you do when you're reading it? Nothing. Not a whole lot of. Um, bring me a songu. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go the next day. Well, the day after, I guess. Um, ba ba bum, ba 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 bum. Guess I'll do this. Wait, what did that say? Right now, the Temperance Arcana may help me grow even more. Oh, okay. Uh, Part-time master, sure. Looks like it teaches skills in customer service, accounting, and product stocking. Prove your skill set. Start with a promotion. End up a billionaire. Elon Musk, eat your heart out. A series of easy-to-understand instructions begins to play. I finished learning about a number of workplace skills. I feel like I can apply this knowledge to my part-time work. The amount of money you can you earn from part-time jobs is increased. Good luck. There will be a full moon tonight. A powerful shadow will appear. Final battle is nearly upon us. I should stay home today and conserve my strength. I found it! It's at the south end of the Moonlight Bridge! The twelfth and final shadow. Hmm. So this is it. And as we expected, I'm detecting more Persona users nearby. It's Draga. They know this is their last chance. We expect it as much, but don't be careless. So, it's them. <laughs> Saves us the trouble of looking for them. You've all fought admirably thus far. This will be our last operation. Let's all come back safely. Got it. Roger that. Of course. Final battle is here. The last shadow and Strega await us. This is serious. I should choose my team lineup carefully. Well, I mean, it's all well and good, but not knowing how I'm going to be fighting is it's kind of a detriment <laughs> the day I've been waiting has for us finally come I'll leave the rest to you all a new future is upon us okay I think I'm going to go <laughs> with my regular team so I'm gonna go with Yukari. Yeah. With Akihiko. And <laughs> Mitsuru. Why is he not graying out? Oh. 
Oh my god, Fuka, I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, she's uniform. There we go. I'm so sorry, Fuka. <laughs> Let's see. I'm just curious. Let's see what else uh, like Akihiko has. Summer garb. Yasugami. Oshujin, that's um That's Persona 5. This is Persona 4. This is Persona 5. Insert. Ah. I gotcha. That's a uh, Persona 5 reference. Yukari Red Latex. Okay, I'm just curious. I'm going to put everyone in their Persona 5 suits. Or kind of classic. Cyber Gear. Phantom Suit. All right. Yeah, that's so sick, man. Look at them all. <laughs> Koromaru, that's so funny. These costumes are not half bad. Oh, he's, uh, he's Yosuke. I am so... Man, I love Joker's costume so much. Joker is the main guy in uh, Persona 5. These are all costumes from Persona 5. The funny thing is, Koromaru is wearing the costume of a cat. I'm so playing... Like, if I play again, I'm so wearing these costumes. Uh, one of the best characters. Okay. Let's put them all back. Okay. Um, oh. One other thing. So, Yukari. So, Earth Badge. Uh, regenerate 2. Hmm. Oh, right, I have to change mine. Uh, so I have the felt. Um, maybe she can get... Regenerate 3. Uh, at least that way she can potentially stay up longer. Uh, and then Akihiko... I'm tempted to put high counter, but I, again, I don't know what we're fighting. And he's the one to put this on. He's the one, because he's physical, right? He's got the physical stats. And I will give her 50 HP. No, sorry, 50 SP. What has she got now? Endurance 5? No, 50 SP. Um, wow, surprisingly... Akihiko has low attack. So, oh, it's because of the thing. Um, 
Yeah, let's do regenerate instead. You know what? Fuck it. Berserker seal. Alright. Let's stop dilly dallying and get to it. So I have Yukari, Akiko, yes. and Mitsuru. Are you ready? Commence operation. Mm. Yes. Well, then we're off. All right, be careful. Let's go. Final battle is here at last. But first, there are two powerful adversaries we have to confront. At the south end of the Moonlight Bridge. What the fuck is that? I trust you know what is at stake today. You claim you hunt the shadows to prevent the disaster they bring. Yet, countless lives are lost each day, even without their intervention. <sighs> the ability to use a persona is not in itself evil. You have no reason to forsake it. So, why not just admit it? You do not truly wish to eliminate the Dark Hour. You are merely deceiving yourselves in the pursuit of self-satisfaction. You're wrong. I don't think you truly believe that. <sighs> you are foolish children indeed. Erasing the Dark Hour is the same as erasing yourselves. How can you not even conceive such a thought? Your imprudence is truly beyond comprehension. As I believed, our goals are irreconcilable. It's time, Jin. What a bunch of fools. I can't stand to look at you. Fate shall decide which of us will remain. Come. Why not? Pull the trigger. Some fun, Persona. This work. Persona. I'll hit them where it hurts. Go for it! Get the layer! You guys just don't know when to quit. Off you go! Now then, it is time for your judgment. Out of my way! Oh, he's doing almighty attacks. on this enemy? I see. So this is what we're up against. Analysis complete! Okay, so no dark, and no light, and no fire. What Let's focus do? on this guy. For so oh. oh my god, really? I have to do this. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. One step at a time. Oh I'm shit! Not what I wanted to do. What's the plan here? Persona. There you go. Who am I? 
Oh, you got this. this. Huh? Hecaton Punch! Someone's confused now, see me. It's unpredictably. Eo! The best bet would be. Caesar! Shall I move to strike? All right, that's enough of a warm-up. It's time for the real deal. There you go. You think you can hit me? Her soul. What to do? Hecaton! I might as well try both. Ooh, nice. I fear I think I can use it now. Ooh, nice. Thank you. Uh, come. What next? Going down. I'll take care of this. I've got this. I'll hit them where it hurts. How about this? You better watch it. Damn. These guys are tougher than I thought. There you go. You go for it. We shall show. Oh, they shift Death too. To Madoon, oh fuck you. Bad. <laughs> they can coordinate their attacks too. Try not to let them target your weaknesses. Persona. He gets another turn. I figured this wouldn't be easy. Stay sharp, everyone! <laughs> Looks like this is it. One down. This is your yeah, buddy! Aw, uh, no Mitsuru, though. That's okay. Pay for that. Read this will do the trick. You're doing great. Persona. It appears you have more than just luck on your side. So be it. Persona. Oh, you you need to get out, sad, isn't it? What to do? Now's the time. You can't oh, come on. Don't One let the fear get time. to you. I'll hit them where it hurts. No. Fuck. Shall I move to strike? I'll show you. Two is fate. I'll go with Hecaton Pull the trigger. Oh, fuck off, Yukari. Right now. I'll hit them where it hurts. Her
fighting others with the same power. And what difficult opponents they are. Look at how you squander your potential. It's beyond comprehension. Persona! I might as well use uh, the Theurgy now. I don't know if it'll save for the next battle. Stay where you are. Huh? Ooh. That's okay. <clears throat> so this is the true ability of such a favorite Persona user. Persona! Give it up, bro. This can't be. What is that? Temporarily raises the defense at the start of battle. Nice. So, us experiments can't even stand up to a naturally awakened persona. Experiments? For us, it's not so simple. Our powers weren't awakened naturally. We can't even use them without straining our bodies. Don't you remember what your dead pal was carrying? So you were giving Shinji the suppressants? You guys don't have the slightest clue what'll happen if the Dark Hour disappears, do you? It won't matter for normal people, since they don't remember anything anyway. But without the Dark Hour, even Persona users like us will... Mm? Jin, that's enough. Now then, ordinarily we would withdraw here. But that is not an option tonight. This body, ephemeral though it may be, is worthless without my power. Therefore, I've only one choice. I shall prove my existence here and now. <gasps> what are you doing? Don't be so reckless. Jin? Sorry, but I haven't forgotten what you said to me. You win. Go on and defeat the Shadow. Maybe then you'll see what you've been fighting for this whole time. Wait a sec. Don't tell me you're gonna jump! I'd rather die than surrender to you! <laughs> Take a good look! This is how we live! They jumped. What the hell? Don't let it get to you. They chose how they wanted to go out. We're not done here yet. Our real target is waiting. Let's just focus on that for now. Leader! The last shadow is floating in front of us. I'm not sensing any movement from it. Let's prepare here, then head for battle. So it looks like they do carry over. That's that's good. It's very good. Okay. Um, it really makes you think, eh? What are they going on about? What do we not know? I mean, there's a lot we don't know, but what happened? What does happen if we get rid of the dark hour? What what were they talking about? Well, only one way to find out. I really hope I have the right team. Oh god, yes. what is this? Alright, this is it. Are you ready? 
Let's go. This is the final battle. I'll do everything I can to support you. Just please be careful out there. body floating up there if it's that high your attacks won't have the range to reach it what kind of saw fucking saw inspired thing is this wait but i'm picking up similar readings from those statues down there i mean saw came after but you know what i mean there's a connection with the floating target i'm sure of it not even my arrows can reach that far Target is out of range. I have to do it. Yes, I'll protect you all. I'm still setting up. It'll, It'll take time. a little more time. Against lightning, okay. One of them is. Who's gonna win this? I've got it. What's the plan here? Persona! <laughs> this will do the trick. Go for it! Put the layer! Fire. Okay. Here's oh. what I found. Light or piercing. What to do? Hecaton fire! Sonata Sunpai's panicking! What? Never mind. I've already scanned this one. No, uh sh shift. No, oh, whatever. You're distressed. What next? Just take a deep breath. There's no One step at a time. Yeah. So here's the question. In this situation. Do we lower the defense first or just attack? You know what? Just fucking attack. It ignores the distances, right. I think, anyway. Here I go. And with this, you're finished. Oh my god. It's gonna win this. Oh, I meant to do the other one. Oh, well. Too late. Persona! No mercy! That's me! Child's play. Oh, that was like close. Nice. Attacks, eh? Oh, can I 
summon them. Fuck. The shadow is back in the air. You can't attack it anymore. Should I scan on this enemy? I have to do this. Time to jump. One step at a time. Persona! Shall I move to strike? And this Oh no! Punch you in this one. No. So that one is really against that. Do not heal. Ha! <laughs> nice. That's how we do. the trick. Persona. Oh, jeez. I'm getting an unusual energy reading from the main body. Too slow. Bro, I'm so glad I upgraded the boots for the evasion. Um, 
I doubt this will this thing will I doubt it's like uh it'll block poison. I doubt that thing will be able to be shocked either. Now you die! Okay, so it looks like it'll it'll only only does one. Picking up a powerful reading from the statue. This one's not like the others. Let's do what we can to take it down. Did I scan on this enemy? Analysis complete. It's resistant to everything. You know, all in all, we're actually doing okay. We're doing really well. I doubt it'll be. I, I highly doubt. Go for it. Got the layer. You know, I probably should have gone with the um, lower defenses. Uh, Pull the trigger. Some fun, Persona. One step at a time. Let's go. Sure. I can use it now. Why not? Ooh. What's the plan here? How about so lot attack. Just in case it has like some big ass attack. I want to make sure everyone's like properly healed up. It's gonna win this. Lower his attack. God, how many actions does that take? Amazing. Oh, you can do all that attacks against him. Oh, 
I'll take care of this. I've got this. I'm ready. I'll show you. This isn't good. This doesn't Ooh. look good. I'll go with. In this situation, some fun, Persona. That helps. Oh, appreciate it. One step at a time. Caesar. What's the plan here? Here we go. He's done. Defeated the hangman, a sense of finality. <laughs> I've learned a new skill. Uh okay, concentrate. You know what? I'm okay not having concentrate. I'm actually okay with that. Lowers all the foe's defenses. Uh, I was like, what do you want me to do? <laughs> Operation is over. Or should I say, mission complete. Yes. It's finally over. Leader, I believe a celebration is in order. What will be our victory cheer? Let's eat. One, two, three. Let's eat. Let's... eat? <laughs> what was that? Huh. I wonder if Vigas-san can even get hungry. So, Kirijo-senpai, you're gonna help us with the victory party tomorrow, right? You certainly don't waste any time. Well, I do suppose we've earned it. Well, in that case, how about sushi? Oh, I cover some sushi, sushi right now. Hmm. It has been a while. Well, I've got dibs on the halibut and sea urchin. Oh, uh, then I call the fatty tuna. Uh, oh, we're divvying it up already? Um, can I get the salmon roe then? I will get the barbecue wheel, please. Hey, wait a minute. You can't do that. I reserve the fatty tuna, bluefin, shrimp, squid, scallops, and sea eel. I call hey, the eel. That's not fair! You don't even eat! How immature. Fighting over sushi. Hey, listen, what? kid. Mitsuru san, please order Tamago for me. They say you can tell a chef's skill by how he prepares eggs. A chef's skill? Jeez, how old are you again? Seriously. Okay, okay. I'll have the very best delivered tomorrow. You mean it? Oh, man! I'm so glad I'm still alive! Junpei, you can have the leftover dried gourd roll. What? But it was my idea in the first place! <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's time to say goodbye to the dark hour. Even though it seemed like a curse, for some reason I feel sad to see it go. Yeah. That's a gorgeous scene, man. Like, it's eerie as fuck, but... You know, like, the clouds and the moon so huge and fucking close. Tidal waves and earthquakes everywhere on the planet should be going on, but... You know, video games. We really did it, didn't we? Yes, we've saved the world, even if no one knows it. 
Yeah. Yeah. The battle has ended. The dark hour has come to an end. Or has it? Yes. Or has it? We'll see. Good morning. This is the first time we've talked during the day. Isn't this weather lovely? This really is the start of a new day for both of us. All the fragments of my memory are finally back together. I understand my purpose now. The time has come. I know this is going to hurt, but there's something I have to tell you. This is goodbye for you and me. In my eyes, our friendship was a miracle. I want you to know that. But even miracles don't last forever. If only they did. I guess that's true. I will always treasure the time we had together. Today may be the end, but the bond between us can never be severed. Remember that. Peros is looking at me with teary eyes. Since a strong bond. I am thou. Thou art I. The, we, the ultimate form. The death social link reached its maximum level. You can now fuse Thanatos, the bringer of death. It was fun while it lasted so long. Wonder if we'll ever see him again. Morning. Hope your stomach's up to celebrating tonight, because we're going to stuff our faces with sushi. Oh, I'm so ready. I'm actually yeah, really jealous. Seriously. Me too. I haven't eaten anything since yesterday. Better come back right after school, man. I'll be waiting. Okay, there are plans for a celebration to be held tonight. Hell yeah! Woohoo! School's out, and boy, do I have a hankering for sushi tonight. Just wait for me, my precious beloved sushi. I'll be sure to come home hungry. So, I'm going to take the long way home to work up an appetite. You go on ahead without me. Hey, uh, someone looks happy today. What's the occasion? Wait, don't tell me you actually got a girl. Well, did you? Come on, dish it out. Well, I mean, Yukari and I are kind of dating. You know, just, just say it. <sighs> I could finally get back to living a normal life. But, honestly, it feels kind of weird. Well, let's just have fun celebrating tonight. Oh, I gotta stop by the archery team. I'll see you later. Parties are too much effort. You have to think about a location, what to feed everyone, what activities to coordinate. Ugh, just thinking about it makes my mouth dry. Um. Do I just. Oh, return to dorm. Alright. Should I go back to the dorm now? yet. Oh, I guess I have to go that way. Maybe the other door. Damn. Alright. Let's do it. Damn! This is some primo sushi. It's pretty dang good. The slices are huge! Man, I'm starving! Can we eat? Hey, where are Aige-san and Ikutsuki-san? He took her to the lab for a tune-up or something. He said they'll join us later. <laughs> the chairman just can't stay away from the lab, can he? That must be my father. Daddy! We've been waiting for you. So it's finally over, then. That's right. H who's he? Can't you tell? That's Kirijo-senpai's dad. She looks exactly like him. 
You think so? Congratulations, everyone. You've done well. No words can express my gratitude. Though you'll never receive the recognition you deserve, your achievement was truly monumental. Thank you, really. <laughs> to you, I owe a special thanks for lending us your power until the very end. Oh, it was no big deal. Thanks to you, the 12 shadows behind all this chaos have been destroyed. You've carried this burden long enough. You deserve a chance to experience the joys of youth. As of midnight tonight, the Specialized Extracurricular Execution Squad will be disbanded. Disbanded? Oh, right. No longer must you risk your lives in battle. Tomorrow, you can triumphantly return to a normal school life. Is something the matter? Nah, it's nothing. All right, everyone. It's time to celebrate. Your feast awaits. And don't worry about holding back. Eat as much as you'd like. Sweet! Freaking finally! Listen up, everyone. Now that we're good and stuffed, how about we take a picture together? A picture? Actually, I did try to take one last night. Except I forgot it doesn't work during the dark hour. You mean you brought a camera with you to the battle? Well, yeah. I mean, it was our last battle and all. I probably would have done the same thing. <laughs> Excuse me, mister. You mind taking our picture? Ugh, you feel like such a tourist. But, you know, I do kind of want a picture, too. Oh, wait. Ikutsuki-san and Aigis aren't here. I guess we'll have to take another one later. All right, everyone, get together. Come on, squeeze in tight. Everyone, get real close to me. You want me close, too? <laughs> uh, no, not you. Jeez, oh, don't make the poor camera guy wait all day. Hey, we're good to go. You can take the picture whenever. How's this for a pose? It's all right. Yeah, hey, get your hand out of my face. Sounds about right. <sighs> Is it just me, or did this not get my good side? We'll just take another one when I guess and Akutsuki san get back, all right? Yes, yes, we hear you. I could really get used to this worry free lifestyle. Morph. How about you, Koro-chan? Are you excited for all this meat? What? Celebration party continues. I spend a moment of relaxation with my battle-weary friends. Rank 7 of the Fool. Hey, how come nobody's eating? Don't tell me you're full already. Are you kidding? I'm stuffed. Yeah, me too. I couldn't eat another bite. How about you, senpai? I'll gladly have some. I'm good for now. Nah, suit yourself. For Maru, you hungry? Don't give the dog raw fish, you'll make him sick. I guess an Akutsuki san sure are running late. And just look at the time. It's almost midnight. A dark hour, you say? guys in the suits transmogrified <laughs> the dark hour still happening senpai what's going on i'm not sure guess i was right to have my doubts yeah something didn't feel right 
Say what? Hey, do you hear that? It sounds like a bell, but where's it coming from? Where is Ikutsuki? And he hasn't even called. What could he be doing with Igis that's making him so late? <sighs> Mitsuru? Everyone, prepare to move out. We're heading for Tartarus. Um, to do what? I don't know, but that's where the sound is coming from. We have to find out what's going on. Ikutsuki-san. What the fuck? I guess? What are you doing here? <sighs> She's simply here to fulfill her role. As a weapon, that is. What? Ikutsuki-san! What are you trying to pull? You said the Dark Hour and Tartarus would disappear if we defeated the Twelve Shadows. That's why we've been fighting this whole time. So why? What are you trying to accomplish? Destroying the shadows, getting rid of the Dark Hour. It was all a lie, wasn't it? You've known since the beginning. Excellent deduction, Kirijo-kun. Unfortunately, you're too little too late. No. You tricked us? It's all going just as I planned. It's no accident that the Dark Hour and Tartarus continue to exist. I never intended for you to rid the world of them. Quite the opposite, in fact. What do you mean? The Twelve Shadows were parts of a whole. They were destined to be reunited. And thanks to your diligence, that destiny has been fulfilled. Death, the Almighty shall soon arise and bring forth the fall. Death? What are you saying? Why would you want that? The end shall come and free this world from despair. Kutsuki's out of his fucking mind, eh? It will be the death of everything, but also the beginning. What is he saying? Is he out of his mind? You see, I too was a scientist on the project ten years ago. The experiment did go awry, but that wasn't the reason the Dark Hour and Tartarus came to be. They manifested as a result of harvesting the Shadow's power, just as the experiment was designed to do. That's why your grandfather gathered so many shadows. To initiate the fall. That can't be! Humanity has overrun this world, turning it into a barren void in the process. The only hope of salvation lies in ruin. I've okay, sorry to pause. I've never understood that. People are like, humanity would be better off if everything just died. It's like I, why? Only hope of salvation lies in ruin? I never understood that concept. According to the prophecy. The fall will be orchestrated by a prince. And once he has delivered us all, he shall rule the new world as king. The attempt years ago failed, but the time has come at last. I am that prince. This is insane. Are you serious with this shit? I do apologize for deceiving you, but all your hard work has paved the way for the future. Stay at my side for just a bit longer, and you too will find salvation. Find it how? By dying? I have a question for you. And what's that? In that video from my dad. He said the shadows had to be defeated. Was that a lie too? Ah, uh, that was in fact his recording. Of course I had to modify it to my specifications. You doctored it? 
Such an unsavory way to phrase it. Forged Your it. father, Eiichiro Takeba, was a superb scientist. He didn't know me at the time, but I truly respected him. While others focused on the Shadow's abilities, his research led him somewhere far deeper. But unfortunately, he couldn't comprehend the magnificent potential of the fall. What? He left that recording at the expense of his life. So it seems. But it did come in quite handy. I'm sure he'd be happy knowing that. So you were behind it all? You used my dad! And me too! Used is such an ugly word. It had to be done for the sake of the world. Our job is to right the wrongs of the past. And we intend to do just that. Senpai, what are you- <sighs> I was hoping you'd be able to see the light. But you are just kids, after all. Maybe my expectations were too high. I guess it's time you fulfilled your role. Capture them and prepare them for sacrifice. Understood. Energy output at maximum. I guess what's wrong? I guess please. Engaging. Not seen time. Oh shit. Well, I guess we lost. Gekkon High School Observatory is now a part of Tartarus. What's going on here? Seems I was unconscious. What the hell? What is this? Damn it! I can't get these off! Father! Ikutsuki, what is the meaning of this? It's exactly what it looks like. They are our sacrifices. Harbingers of the fall. All the pieces are in place. And now, the prophecy shall be fulfilled. What? Bastard! You're full of shit! My, my, how lively. I guess... Affirmative. Father! You traitor! Are you insane? Far from it. You know, your father was an unfortunate man. After all this time, even his own son can't comprehend his vision. My father was wrong. Death as deliverance is an ideology no one should ever embrace. Seriously. You fool. You've become nothing but a burden. I guess this man will be our first sacrifice. Now, deliver unto him. No, please, I guess don't. <laughs> What are you doing, I guess? I... I... <sighs> Fine! I'll do it myself! Ten years. I've wasted ten long years! I am not like your father. I won't make any exceptions! Father! 
just... I guess... execute the sacrifices now! I'm putting an end to this! Hey, come on, I know you wouldn't do this! Do it, I guess! Machine, I'll do it. Koromaru! Good boy. It's all over, Chairman. <laughs> you don't get it, do you? Why do you waste your time searching for a reason to live in this broken world? There's no point to it at all. The only possible way to fix this is to start over. <laughs> Yes. Yes, I was chosen. I'm going to be the god of the new world! <laughs> what a shame. I was so close. <laughs> How did it come to this? Ikutsuki san! Father! Father! <laughs> father! My father once made a promise. He swore he would atone for putting our generation in danger even if it cost him his life. But I. I wanted him to live. I became a Persona user so I could protect him! <laughs> Itsura slumped to the floor, crying like a child. Soon the Dark Arrow will end. Sonata picked up the stunned Mitsuru. Everyone returned to the dormitory in silence. What the fuck, eh? What in the ever-loving fuck? Yesterday was a shocking turn of events. I wonder if Mitsuru will be alright. What's gonna happen to us all now? Cheerful music! Excuse me. Did you hear? Well, actually... Soon Council President's father died from an illness, right? I can't even imagine what it's like to lose a parent. Mm. Yeah. I think I'll help my mom with some chores when I get home. It's a message from Sonata. I want to touch base with everyone on where we're at. Come back to the lounge. Or come to the lounge as soon as you get back. Looks like they cleared out the chairman's room. Well, no surprise there. Ikis isn't here either. Uh, I just can't believe all this. It's in the papers too. Kirijo Group CEO dies suddenly. They're blaming it on an illness, though. 
Yeah, it's never the truth. <sighs> nope. Grijo's senpai's not here, huh? She's an only child, so there's a lot to be settled. Like the funeral and the family business. She'll probably have her hands full for at least a week. That sounds rough. I hope she'll be okay. So, what are we supposed to do now? <gasps> What'll happen to Chidori? No word yet. They're probably too busy to be thinking about that. In fact, the entire Kirijo group must be in a state of panic. I hope Igis is okay. Yeah. Man. I want to hear what they have to say, but they haven't made a peep. Am I supposed to just wait for them to get their act together? Mitsuru's meeting with the company execs. Might explain the delay. Yeah. But still, what are we going to do? We have no idea how to get rid of the Dark Hour. We don't even know who to fight now. He kept saying stuff about the fall. What would have happened if we were sacrificed? I can't even imagine. Hmm. So many unanswered questions. Yeah. But standing around here isn't going to solve anything, right? True. But there is one thing we know. Tartarus is still around and shadows are swarming the place. We should train so we're ready for whatever we might be up against. Right. All right, that's it for tonight. Try to get some rest, even if you can't sleep. Okay. Roger that. Oh, right! Yukari-chan! What's this? A disc? Um, there were traces of a video on the chairman's PC. A lot was deleted, but I was able to restore some of it. And, well, I think it's something you need to see. <sighs> Thanks, Fuka. I'll be sure to watch this later. Mm hmm. Just don't forget. So it's just a normal DVD? Is it? I have a pretty good idea of what the DVD is. Most likely the original cut of uh, her father. Or at least a goodbye message from her father. Alright, let's see what's on here. Oh, there we go. I can only hope that this recording reaches someone with a conscience. Isn't this... That video? My employer has become obsessed with a loathsome idea. This experiment should never have been conceived. That's why I had to do something to put a stop to it. <laughs> However, in doing so, I released a number of shadows that are certain to torment future generations. But I didn't have a choice. If I didn't do this, it could have destroyed the entire world. Please. You need to listen very carefully. Whatever you do, it is imperative that you do not hunt the shadows that have dispersed. Uh-huh. This part's... I wasn't able to do anything to stop this madness. He won't listen to a word I say. He's been seduced by the devil's temptations. Those monsters will try to reunite and become one again. If they succeed, then we're all doomed. I'll say it once more. Do not go after the shadows that were released! And this is the original video. The real one, before Gutsky went and tampered with it. Dad was trying to put a stop to the experiment. There's not much hope for me now. I have just one request. Whoever finds this, please give my daughter Yukari <laughs> this message. I know I promised I'd be home soon, and I'm sorry to break that promise. But I want you to know, as your father, I was never happier in my life than when I was with you. This really is my dad. I love you, Yukari. Please, take care of yourself. Dad? Dad? <laughs> I know one thing for sure now. I was right to believe in you. 
I'm doing okay. It took a while, but I finally got your message. The resolution in Yukari's heart has awakened a new persona. Yukari's persona, Io, has given rise to Isis. Next magic attack will deal more than double the damage for all allies. Wow! That is I'll fight powerful for what I believe as fuck. It. That's what you would have wanted. Right, Dad? And on that note, guys, that brings this episode to a close. Quite the turning point, huh? When I first played this game, once we got to this point, I was... I was taken aback. Like, it, to put it mildly. And keep in mind, this is after I played Persona 5 and 4. This was my third Persona game. I did not see this plot twist coming at all. And it made me wonder, like, what... What do we... Where do we go from here? What the fuck do we do? It's, um, this is one of my favorite plot twists uh, ever, because nobody sees this coming. You know, I Ikutsuki, his motivations, whatever, he, he thinks the world would be better off in ruin, whatever, nothing new. But, you know the theme of death and coming to terms with it like now Mitsuru's dad is dead and it'll be a little while before we see her again but life goes on uh, the dark hour is still around and what the fuck do we do this this is the turning point of the game this is where things start to get serious um, in the coming episodes it's going to get very morose, very, um, like very, um, very dark. Um, even the music will change. Let's put it that way. Um, although that's kind of typical for all for the Persona games. Like after a certain point, the music kind of changes. The regular music. But yeah, heavy episode, man. Um, and as I said, it's just a start. It sucks that it takes about 70 hours to get to this point. But, you know. It, it's worth it. It's a fantastic game. Hope you guys are looking forward to more. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in the next one. Take care.